Okay, this is a teaching video for standing wall thoracic. We're going to start with motion palpation. Can I open your gown? Yep. So we're skin on skin. And I'm going to have you place your our hands on your shoulders, and then I'm going to kind of take your body weight to lean forward for me, and I'm just going to use my palm against the spinus to induce extension, feeling for any restrictions, going down the thoracic spine, and you can also do rotation, pushing on the transverse processes, as well as lateral flexion on the spinous processes. You can do this on both sides. You can put your hands down like to rotate. Not a reflection. All right, and then we're going to say we found T6 flexed on T7 with an extension restriction. So we're going to go to the wall to do the standing wall thoracic adjustment. So a patient is going to be against the wall. I'm going to undo your again. So put your lower back against the wall against the wall and walk your feet out a little bit and then block out your knees and then I'm going to place my metacarpal phalangeal joint on the spinous process of T6 that I want to extend and then I'm going to have you go hold your arms over and the arm away from me is the one below and then the head is just going to be kind of tucked in but not um, too far flexed or extended we just don't want the head to hit the wall and then I'm going to form a V with my hand and my body which is going to go right on her elbows like that and then I'm going to get down in a low crouch and the impulse is going to come from my legs so I'm going to find my contact on T6 placing the metacarpal phalangeal on the spinous and then I'm going to get down in my V and have my patient take a deep breath in and then get make sure everything's nice and tight and then on the end of her exhalation I'm going to just extend my legs with the impulse A to P and slight like IS.